were a number of people uh, gathered there, um, and there was a shot from the crowd. So that's why we really need the uh, public's in involvement. This is something that has made us all angry and disgusted uh, that somebody would just indiscriminately shoot in a crowd. Um, so they're talking to a number of witnesses, but so many more people could step up and um, I, n not tolerate something like this that would happen in the capital city. And that's the thing that you're mentioning is asking people to step up because this person is still out there after doing something as horrible as this. Have you had any leads or people giving you any information at all? There have been and um, they've interviewed a number of, of people but not enough that were in the crowd that, that could easily identify who was the one who uh, uh, shot this little girl indiscriminately. Yeah. Tell me more about T Kingsbury Square. How many buildings are there? And is, is there a big common area where people congregate? Yeah, there, there are a couple of hundred people live in the two towers and, and flanked in between the two towers is a common area where often people congregate and um, will, will be out there, particularly during warmer weather. And uh, it's just uh, surprising that this commotion happened. And, and then uh, somebody was shot in the, from, out, from inside the crowd. Um, and it's just a, a really shame to cut down somebody so innocent yeah, and cool. so much alive. Um, our hearts go out to the children of the Parker School, um, where they're going to have crisis counselors today. Um, but uh, this little girl was such a sweetheart. Uh, I've been hearing from neighbors and people in the community about how, how much... Um, bright future she had ahead of her um, and just always had a great smile. Yeah, and the fact that she loved to dance and sing, mm -hmm. and we've been hearing, and skate, and she was energetic, always happy, and we've been showing photos of her where she's smiling. I mean, just as cute as can be, and this is sad. And when you mentioned that it was a gathering and there was a lot of commotion, I guess that's going to make this difficult to find that person, the fact that it was a crowd, people were moving around, um, and I would assume that would make it that much harder. It is, but there's somebody who ha absolutely saw something, You're dark, right? and uh, people talk, and we just really hope that uh, the public would either contact the Mercer County Prosecutor's Office or the Trenton Police, Yeah, and it could be an anonymous tip or otherwise, but we are following leads that are given in. Yeah, somebody knows something. Somebody knows. Somebody mm -hmm. saw it, heard it, somebody knows. Uh, so is uh, we keep I keep reading articles about an uptick in violence in your in, in Trenton. Is that true? Yeah, but it's definitely real. My daughter gone. She's a good girl, good heart, always smiling, always happy. She just loved to do everything, just play, skate, everything.